Hey, look who's here, Steve Spangler. It's hey, Monday, look. and look at all this. This is a we dilemma. We need to do a show behind the show, kind of what we talk about in the break yeah, and everything like else. Yeah, like all the that important would... things, yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys know this, but Halloween's right around the corner. Really? No, and you're I don't, so yeah, excited. Yeah, you know, it's a, lot of people, a lot of people would wait until next week for Halloween. Yeah, Not yeah. this guy. No, no. Started in September. Five things you gotta have for a Halloween party. I know a lot of people worry about this stuff ahead of time. I'll tell you up at the, at the very front of this that we put all the stuff at facebook.com slash Steve Spangler okay. and put the extra videos. Um, glowing things, number one. You gotta have things that glow, so of course you gotta go out and get your black light for the party. Yeah. Okay. A couple things uh, about glowing stuff. Here is a regular uh, like uh, pumpkin that you find, a you know, plastic pumpkin, pumpkin at the store, but you could use a real pumpkin. The secret is this material here, this glow powder. Right. Um, it's called zinc sulfide. You can find it in a bunch of different places, but you now just take the pumpkin and you spray it with adhesive, uh -huh. and you can put uh, triangles if oh, you want to or whatever. and then put that powder and then when you put it out there, it glows in the dark, which is kind of a cool thing, and it looks cool. Ooh. This is another a substance called atomic glow. So look at the big graduated cylinder that's here. And when we pour this in here, oh, you start to see that. Oh, uh, look at the glow. I know it would look better if we dim the lights, but it's hard to dim so the, the lights. So the black light is hitting that. I know, and it's it, just it would really it glows. be glowing without light. Yeah. But guess what? If you have an adult party, tonic water glows beautifully. So uh, gin and tonics are a wonderful thing, and um, uh -huh. so that can that's, you can you consume that? Yeah, no, that's why you have a gin and tonic. Okay. That's why that's great. So uh, here on Nine <laughs> News, we debuted years ago. Fake blood. My mom and dad were in that business for years yes. and years and years. Whole nother Oprah at a different time. But uh, look at this. You've got to learn how to make fake. Uh, oh my gosh, very this realistic. is good. I put the the whole video at Facebook. Uh, the secret is the cornstarch and the chocolate cocoa. Really? Yeah. And but this looks good, doesn't it? Because it's not their color right color otherwise. Yeah. 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 See, look at this. It's no, that's so we've, very, we've very got real. the greatest fake fake blood in the whole world. Hey. Would you look at this? You get a balloon because you're going to need a party favor, and you drop a hex nut. So this is a hex nut. Right. Drop the hex nut into the balloon like this. Kim, this will be yours. Tom, reach over and get yours. <gasps> okay. So now watch what happens. Here's your party favor. So now spin the balloon like this. Listen. Oh, it's a screaming balloon. Do you like that? Oh, listen to that. <gasps> Centripetal force. This is a parent's nightmare because a kid does this all day long and night. Yes. And pretty, uh, it's a centripetal force inside right. their body. Okay, stop it, stop it, okay. stop oh, it, stop right, it, knock oh, that off. Finally, would you look at this? I love to go to the door and have something great happening. So here is the secret. Here is the cauldron that has the hot water. Tub of hot yeah. water. Got it? So now you put the dry ice inside here. Right. You can pull it out if you want to later on, but you put this inside here. And now I want to go to the door and have it all smoking and everything. When you reach in and you get, oh, careful, it's only cold. Cold. All right, so there Don't you go. Touch. Nice, it's nice. Now below. look at this. So now you take your candy. So look at the candy here. Right. Oh, yeah, Protect yeah, yeah. it in the bowl, and you hide it inside <gasps> this one here, like this. Oh, so genius. look at this. Look at this. Go for a wide shot, Les. Go for a wide. Look at this. So now you reach in and you say, "Oh, candy free," and it's perfectly uh, fine. Uh, uh, Isn't that great? Spooky. And it looks like you're just reaching into the cauldron and getting candy, but because it's separated, it doesn't get wet at all, and the kids go nuts. <gasps> the Spangler House is a fun house to visit. That's why we. Shut the doors and turn off the lights. So it's, uh, it's <laughs> mom and, mom, the boys are like, Dad, are we going to do it again? That's and you say yes. Cool. But now when the Love kids that. leave, you just kind of reach in and you pull it out, okay. and everything is just fine. So good. Is it cold? See, it's no, it's delicious. Good. It's deliciously good. Would you like okay. one, Tom? Good good. I'm no calories. Have one. No calories. Okay. Right. Hey, Great we, uh, ideas for Halloween, I love it. and we put it all on Facebook. Cut it. And we'll be right back. Thank you. <gasps> I love so, it when the kids come to the door. No, is that kind of a fun way to do it?